And now, by the powers vested in me as a royal dragon of the Ku Klux Klan, I dub thee fellow Klansman. Oh boy. Patrick Malahide plays Inspector Allen in five classic detective stories. This is very irregular, she has So is murder, Sir John. Created by the writer of Making Out, meet the riffraff element. I know it's a bit of a tall order, but I'm looking for a cook. And I'd like to see the cream of what you have on your books. Sorry, Dad, can I introduce you? This is Petula. She's our new cook. And take a break at the seaside town of West Beach done to her? Well, what should I have done? It's like a tarpaulin over her. I mean, at least she looks like she's enjoying herself. Mystery, comedy and drama on BBC One. This Sunday, storytelling is elevated to a fine art in two new series on BBC Two. Journeys into foreign lands as nurses and doctors. One took it for granted that men would fight and that it was our business to go and help them. Teachers and missionaries. Some men in that village had killed a man coming from Orca, which was another village, and eaten him. I never wanted to go abroad. They were all so pious. And I thought, well, I don't want to be a missionary. See life as witnessed by those in their 90s. Then, witness the extraordinary courtroom drama over an extraordinary painting. Exhibit A, the American Belle Ferronniere. Exhibit B, the French Belle Ferronniere. The plaintiff, Mrs. Andre Hahn. The defendant, Sir Joseph Devine. Discover the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth behind the trial to establish which is the real Belle Ferronniere. Every picture tells a story. Sunday, 8.20 on BBC Two. Organs for transplant are becoming an increasingly rare commodity and medical science is seeking solutions to this problem in the use of animal organs. The second part of a long-term 40 minutes investigation explores the emotive issues and diametrically opposed views involved. The program contains scenes of open heart surgery. give you a call to see what's happening when I haven't heard anything from anyone at that bus for a while and wondering if you've found me a heart yet. 
it would be nice to just get it over with. You know? It would be nice to know whether you're going to get the operation, if you're going to be successful, whether you're going to live or not. Because at the moment it's like living on the bit of a, a knife edge and 